welcome guys and ladies welcome uh, to another session of this webinar in this webinar i'll be showing you how you can place trades spot trading how you can do spot trading conveniently and smoothly all you need to do is just to make sure you are following and um, you are not distracted okay in the past webinar in the past video I showed you how you can watch how you can register your account and also how you can use P2P all right P2P to deposit into your account so here there is P2P trading where you can deposit into your account I've gone through that in the previous video and in this video I'll be showing you how to place trades all right how to place trades if you are if you're ready for the advanced class you won't be getting the the um, the videos on what on the interface of Binance and also on the P2P app platform because I believe that you should already know it because you you opted in for the advanced class so you should already know those things I'm only showing you how to place trades because I don't want you guys to get it wrong I want you to know the particular price that you must pick because of course, I have so many people and uh, now they claim that they already know this thing, but they don't. So that is why I'm sharing this video with you. All right. So let's go straight in into the video. Welcome once again. My name remain Kayode Hola and I will be your, what, your facilitator for this current, um, current webinar going on. So let's move on. First thing first, I've explained how all these things works the usefulness of all of this and uh, let's go straight into what into buy and selling of cryptocurrency on our spot trading don't forget all we are doing is the spot trading only we are not going to futures we are not going to futures that will be uh that's another form of trading and i don't want to watch i don't want to expose you into too much risk so what we'll be doing right now is the spot trading and i've explained that this will be your favorite for those coins that you have what picked as favorites so let's assume you want to buy a particular coin now um name my go for let's assume it goes for bnb usdt bnb so there's one thing you need to note we always buy against what usdt don't forget what we deposited from our p2p is usdt so how this advice you will trade against usdt this simply means that you have usdt you want to use it to buy what buy bnb let's assume you are what you have is busd and you want to buy bnb you can actually pick this particular pa these things are called ps they are called PS. So let's assume what you have is BUSD. Maybe maybe your friend sent you BUSD or you have BUSD and you want to have BNB. You don't need to convert your BUSD to USDT. You can buy BNB directly by using BUSD. So all you need to do right now is to do what? Choose the pair with BNB, BUSD. This simply means that you have what? You have BUSD to buy BNB. And you have for, the, for this pair, you have TUSD to buy BNB. For this particular pair, you have USDC to buy BNB. But what we are using is what BNB USD because what we have is USDT. So let's go right in. This is our chart. Of course, you don't have any business with this. Okay, so let's go straight to the buy and sell section. Let's assume you want to buy. Just pick any price. Just pick any one. Either buy or sell. We can always adjust it um, in the next phrase you're going to be seeing now all right so if you want to buy here is what here is here is a buy if you want to sell just click sell okay but what we are doing first what is buying what we are doing first what is buying now as you can see in this wallet i don't have any usdt available in this wallet as you can see it will be showing the available usdt you have it will be showing what the available usdt that you have in your wallet in your wallet so but one thing that you need to notice is that you must have transferred the money that you was that you funded in your what in your in your in your p2p to your spots let me quickly show you how to do that all you need to do is to do what come to wallet come to funding 
once what once you get money and uh, once you what get paid from your p2p it's going to enter your funding then you send the money from what from funding to your what to your p2p then you just go to transfer choose usdt then send the amount of the USD that you have once i press transfer this particular coin will go what you go to my what will go to my spot trading let me just do that transfer confirm transfer it will go to what this particular spot trading don't buy it this um this account is used for purchasing why i have the um a, a, a brand new one for purchasing okay ignore don't mind any of what you have seen here don't go ahead and do it because if you do that it's on your own risk all right so as you can see i now have 57 usdt as my what as my balance now let's go to the to our what to our spot trading after bnb usdt so as you can see it's going to be showing me i have what i have 56 available initially it was not showing me i have anything available because there was no money in the wallet but now i have transferred the money out from my funding to my spot wallet don't forget binance has Binance have different sections. Okay, we have the funding, we have the P2P, we have the spot, we have the futures. So this particular money is in our spot. You can use this particular money in your spot trading to trade futures trading. Okay, get that. So what we need to do now is to what buy a particular coin. Alright. I'm I set this money here for practicing. Alright. So let's assume we want to buy BNB now. Buying make sure i won't go into details all right i won't go into details i won't go into details we have numerous things here that we can use but i won't be going to details because of number one of our time and the code of this webinar of course you have chances to learn more we we and i personally will be telling you our services and how it can be of help to you probably in the next video okay you cannot miss what we have for you you cannot miss it you cannot miss it i must say you cannot miss it you yourself you know how this thing is going you know the standard of video and uh, lesson so you cannot miss what we have for you so let's move ahead and what peak limit what we'll be using is the limit ignore any of this ignore the market ignore the stop limit ignore the oco we don't want to go into that now what we'll be doing is what the limit order so we click the limit and this particular price is bnb price this particular thing you are seeing here is the bnb price so let's assume out to buy 56 usdt you can what i can buy 25 percent of 56 usdt or want to buy 50 percent of 56 usdt or 75 percent of it or 100 percent of it all right so all i need to do if i want to buy 50, 25 percent is the is to what click the 25 percent then which means that the 25 percent of this particular amount is 14 dollars the 50 percent is 26 dollars the seventy percent is five dollars. The hundred percent is what? Of course, fifty-six points. Don't mind the difference between fifty-six point six and fifty-six point nine. It's just the charges that Binance will take from you doing trading with them. Okay, it's a very small charge as you can see. So what I'm showing you now is that you can in input the amount of what you want to buy. Okay, let me let me let me input fifty dollars. As you can see, the amount of fifty dollars is what is what is 0.113 bnb do not forget we want to buy bnb with our usdt which means that 50 usdt will give us 0.113 bnb and i can type any amount i want i can type 20 usdt okay i can try to buy any amount but mind you you can't buy less than 10 dollars on binance you can't buy less than ten dollars on Binance. So all you need to do is to have more than ten dollars. I want to buy. So I can buy twenty dollars. I can buy eleven dollars. But you can't buy less than ten dollars on Binance. So let's move on. Now, just input the amount you want to buy in this particular box. I want to buy forty dollar. So I input forty dollar. All right. What you need to do next is what is to pick price. Like I said, I'll be going into details into how all these prices work. But let me just explain and do what i tell you do exactly what you are seeing on your screen so all we need to do now is what come here and pick price you pick price from here of course the price is already here but we can still pick price from here i will explain all of this so it's very important you pick price from here because there are some times that 
prices here changes and the one particular the one year will not change that's because so far you have opened this particular page what is here will be what is there unless you pick a price from here so let, let me pick a price you can see it's changing it's changing it's changing it's changing it's changing but the price that you need to pick is this one the last one if you want to buy if you want to buy the price that you need to pick is this last one so pick the particular price you don't need me to tell you all the reasons okay you i'm sure you might know it because see, you're for advanced what if you don't know it you can just ignore it okay and um for those that are just coming in if you're if if, if you're just coming from the basic you don't know um how this things works of course like i said i'm not going to details okay i'm not going to details i'm sure that if you are seeing this video right now people watching this video right now you have passed through what you have passed through the interface of binance you have passed through what the p2p you know how to do it that is why you are viewing and watching this video so but of course i'll be going to details even if you don't know it or even you know it okay like i said we have advanced services and we will be letting you know how it works and how you can be part of it like i said do not miss any of it all right so just pick the last price input what you are month and buy if i click buy now the order is going to be executed it's going to be but i don't want to buy bnb okay i don't want to buy bnb on this particular account okay so but let's assume that the price is at 483 points now okay let's assume that you went ahead and pick a price that is 438 watts this particular price of the market but you went ahead and pick what 438.4 and the market price is 439 your order will be placed at pending order. Pending order means you should be waiting for the price to get to what? 43.9 before it will be executed. But so far, we want to buy immediately. We want to buy just market order and it wants to have less charges. Okay? Let's just pick price from here. Just be sure you pick the last price. Pick the last price, input your USDT and buy. Once you buy, you are going to see, be seeing the money in your what? in your spot wallet if you refresh the bnb will come in your spot wallet but because i do not buy on this particular account you are seeing on your screen i do not buy that is why you are not seeing bnb right here now let's go to the selling aspect yes the selling aspect here is how it works just switch what the buy to sell just the same thing but the only difference is what the price you are picking remember in the words in the buy order you pick the price from here but in the sell order you'll be picking the price from here how you why you're picking that price you just save that okay you don't need it for now for now for now you don't need it for now because of further explanation and all of that so let's just skip that so what i'm saying is that if you want to sell pick price from here you pick the first price so i pick the first price Input the amount I want to sell. Of course, I don't have any available BNB. As you can see, I don't have any BNB. Let's assume I bought BNB the other time. It's going to show me the amount I have available. But I don't have any time available. So I'll just input maybe $50 as an example that I have in my account. Press press the words, press pick the price and press sell. Once I press sell, it's what is going to sell BNB back to USDT. Do not forget the pair you are using is BNB slash USDT, which means that if you are buying, you are using what you are using your USDT to buy BNB, and if you are selling, you are using your what you are using your BNB to sell back to what to USDT. So US selling means selling back to USDT, while buying means buying with USDT. So as you can see, I press sold, I press sell, but I press sell, but because I don't have money in my account, you see insufficient fund. I don't have money in my bnb account i don't have bnb coin so that is why i show me insufficient balance so which means that i won't be able to execute this order because i don't have bnb so that is that about how you can buy and sell once you buy you sit in your spot trading and if you want to sell it you can as, let me use this coin as an example you can just come here if, if you if you have bnb here it's going to be displaying here just come here and look for the words for the peer as you can see i can always say Always pair with USDT, so I'll just press embossed USDT if I want to sell, come to sell, pick a price. They are 100%. I can just press sell. 
Once I press sell, the M bus will move back to USDT. All right, so that will be all for this tutorial. That will be all for this particular tutorial. This is what we call spot trading. This is what we call pure spot trading. But of course, there is more to it. Like I said, there is more to it. And uh, we'll be going through that. See if you're coming for our services. Uh, of course, you don't want to miss it. It's not just about this. They have numerous services we have for you for you to make money from the market. You must make money from the market. You must make money from the market. Like I said, the goal is what? The goal and the, the goal and the aim this year is to have 500 to 1,000 what people that are going to be making a millionaire. If you're not a millionaire yet, if they're already a millionaire, they're going to be they're going to be multiplying their money with our services. So I hope to see you soon and I hope to see you in the next lesson. You can't afford to miss it. I'll be talking about something something very very important. So till when we meet again, I wish you guys good luck and stay safe.